Welcome to this YouTube channel. In this video we are going to talk about 10 everyday items we wouldn't have without NASA. So before starting this video like this video. And subscribe to our channel for future updates. NASA has shot us into space, put us on the moon, and is still busy identifying new planets 60 years after it was founded in 1958. But did you realize that NASA has had a significant impact on our daily lives through several highly valuable inventions? Then keep watching to learn about the everyday things for which we should write NASA thank you notes. Number 10. Athletic Shoes. Remember to thank NASA the next time you run in a decent pair of athletic sneakers. Avia, a shoe company founded in the late 1980s, set out on a goal to develop an athletic shoe with a longer lifespan. In 1990, they introduced their compression chamber midsole in collaboration with Apollo Aerospace engineer El Gross, which uses the same technology as space suits to maintain shock absorption, stability, and flexibility features. Number 9. Precision GPS. While Google Maps allows you to go pretty much everywhere, it was only 30 years ago that things were so simple. Thanks to NASA, in the 1990s, space exploration scientists created algorithms that could correct incorrect GPS data. It was originally developed for the U.S. Air Force by NASA, but it has subsequently been made available to commercial and private pilots, as well as most major precision GPS providers. NASA, thank you. Number 8. Computer Mice. It's hard to believe, but the first computer mouse was invented in the 1960s, long before computers were popularized. At the time, a Stanford Research Institute developer named Douglas Engelbart teamed up with NASA's Bob Taylor, who was looking for a simple way to better interact with computer-aided displays, and they developed and patented the first computer mouse with the help of a NASA grant. Number 7. Camera Phones one NASA laboratory team was tasked in the 1990s with finding ways to improve image sensors so that small cameras could be used on spacecraft without reducing image quality. After others voiced concern, lead researcher Eric Fossum created active pixel sensors using complementary metal oxide semiconductor CMOS, technology, and he licensed his innovation. Given that more than a billion CMOS image sensors are being manufactured each year, and are used in practically all digital still and video cameras. It was a smart decision for Fossum. It's quite improbable that we'd have cell phone cameras if not for this invention. Number 6. Memory Foam Sure, NASA is assisting people in reaching the moon, but they're also assisting you in getting a better night's sleep here on Earth. Memory Foam was developed as a cushioning by NASA-funded researchers looking for ways to safeguard pilots during flights in the 1960s. Beds, couches, chairs, shoes, movie theater seats, and even football helmets are all made from it today. Number 5. Water Filtration Devices NASA teamed up with UMP Research Company, URC, in the 1970s to figure out how to purify drinking water on long space missions. They eventually created a device called the Regenerable Biocide Delivery Unit, which removed the requirement for regular cartridge replacements in the purification system. This method is now being utilized to filter huge municipal water systems in a number of poor countries, providing clean drinking water to thousands of people every day. Number 4. Invisible Braces. NASA was able to manufacture invisible dental braces thanks to a collaboration with Ceridine Inc. NASA was able to employ transparent polycrystalline alumnia TPA, a ceramic that is stronger than steel and resistant to shattering, to make invisible dental braces. NASA first employed TPA to develop heat-seeking missile trackers, so that ingenuity that keeps your teeth in line isn't a joke. Number 3. Scratch-Resistant Lenses the Food and Drug Administration FDA, mandated that sunglasses and prescription lenses be shatter-resistant in 1972, resulting in the adoption of plastic over glass. Plastic's disadvantage was that it was not scratch-resistant, despite the fact that it did not break readily. So, after obtaining a NASA license for their scratch-resistant coating technology, which was used on astronaut space helmets and other aerospace equipment, eyewear company Foster Grant combined their own technology, which had been developed over a decade, to produce superior, scratch-resistant plastic lenses in the 1980s. This technology is now used in the majority of lenses marketed in the United States. Number 2. Safety Grooving what does a space agency like NASA have to do with road safety on our home planet? They did, however, 
assist in the implementation of safety grooving, which improves traction on roadways and runways while reducing hydroplaning and sliding. NASA was the first to employ this safety technology to keep aircraft, such as returning space shuttles, safe upon landing. It's been used on commercial airport runways, highways, stairwells, walkways, parking lots, and more since then. A survey by the California Division of Highways, which conducted before and after grooving tests at 14 places, found that grooving reduced what weather-related accidents by 85% when it was introduced publicly in 1985. Number 1. Better Tires NASA not only contributed to the construction of roads, but also to the improvement of tires. NASA engineers collaborated with Goodyear to develop the spring tire in the mid-2000s, which can carry huge weights and conform to any surface, including soft sand and rocky terrain. The two firms teamed up once more to create the super-elastic tire, which can be used on trips to the moon, Mars, and even here on Earth in place of off-road pneumatic tires. Here are a few more examples. Firefighters. When astronauts re-enter the atmosphere, they are subjected to extremely high temperatures. NASA developed a range of heat and flame-resistant textile materials manufactured of polybenzimidazole, or PBI, for use in spacesuits and space vehicles to provide adequate insulation and protection. This material was later introduced in the late 1970s for use in firefighting apparatus, assuming that if it was good enough for astronauts traveling through space, it would be good enough for us on Earth. Household Insulation NASA presumably never envisaged radiant barrier technology having practical applications when it was intended to protect astronauts from intense temperatures. The private sector, on the other hand, has been able to apply this technology to energy conservation strategies in homes and offices. Eagle Shield, for example, is an insulation solution that may be put over existing insulation with the sole objective of lowering heating and cooling expenditures. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.